you believe your father has a clear recollection of who hit who in the ski accident? He has a clear recollection of hearing a scream and, and getting hit from behind, so and he was knocked out. This is literally the question from your deposition, so I'm going to read it and okay. see if your answer is, okay. is yes. Do you believe your father has a clear recollection of who hit whom, whom in the ski accident? And your answer? In my deposition was yes. Okay. And would it surprise you if he takes the stand and like, Two hours and says, "No, I don't." I would that surprise honest, you? When would it surprise you? If he contradicts you in like two hours. Actually, as I reread my deposition, I thought you didn't even answer that correctly. Of course, he doesn't know who hit him because he got knocked out. But so that was your belief. When that was my belief you. at the time, and I was like, I didn't read that question or hear that question yeah. correctly. And you did have an opportunity to make corrections to your deposition, did you not? I did. And you did not make that correction? Um, I actually did took... You, did a, you make that correction or not? I made the corrections and, did I did, and I did not submit that in time because I was told by my dad's attorneys that that will be a red flag and to just drop it. And I did not submit that revised. So did you make other corrections to your deposition that your dad's lawyers told you not to submit? I had made... Yes or no? Did... Did you make again. other corrections to your deposition that your dad's lawyers told you not to, not to give me? Yes or no? I made corrections. Yeah. The answer is yes. It's not a simple yes and no. <laughs> well... I'm not happy if you made corrections to your deposition that were never sent to me. So I'm wondering, you made corrections to your deposition and you gave them to your dad's lawyers? Is no, I did true? not. I did not give them to my dad's lawyers. <sighs> can I rely on your deposition here? Um, can you rely on it? At the moment in time, I believed that my dad knew who hit him. As I reread it, Later at home, I thought that you answered it wrong, Shay. All right. So, what are some other corrections that you've made to your deposition that we I can't, I've I can't, never heard of until this? I moment? can't remember. I think one was that they kept calling Zakia Jackie. Some mostly were just minor clarifications. Do you understand why I might be a little irritated in hearing that you made changes that I never got? Yes, no one got them. They, they never got submitted. Your dad was a workaholic, is that fair? Later in my life, he became a workaholic when my parents' uh, relationship was not as good as it used to be. Your dad, prior to the ski collision, forgot to tell you that he loved you very much. Do you agree? I'm going to have you restate that. These are your words. Your dad forgot to tell me that he loved me very much. Is that true of your dad prior to the ski collision? I... Just say yes or no, please. I forgot my dad. I, I don't recall. Growing up, I'm not making this quote up. Mm -hmm. Growing up, he forgot to tell me. Sure, I can. Page 78, line 16. I'm not trying to. No, if it's there want, in the I want, deposition. I want the quote. He forgot to tell me he loved me very much. Do you agree? This goes to his affection, level of affection after the ski collision. Overruled? So just say yes or no, and we'll move on. Okay. I'm sorry. One more time, and I'll do my best. I may not be able to answer yes or no. Your dad? Okay, quote from you. Mm -hmm. He forgot exactly what I just said. 78 what? 78, line 17. He forgot to tell me he loved me very much. Did you say those words? 
Yes. Okay. Well, Your Honor, read the whole sentence. You just uh, read maybe half the sentence. That could be helpful. He did hug you. Just a minute. Just a minute. You, are you are you Let's impeaching the witness, it. or are, what, what are we doing here? Why don't we Why don't we take a, a recess? It's time for the afternoon recess, and we'll address it.